Did we do it? Are we live? Hi girls, how you doing? Look at how cute you two are snuggling on the couch together. We'll uh, give everybody a second to jump on into the stream. Hopefully the chat will work. Hopefully everything will work because as of right now I see no chats coming in. But hopefully we'll figure it out. All right, I see somebody says hi. Somebody says hi. There's Miss Eleanor. She's down there. Um, so we had a vlog for today and it's ready and it could have went up and I don't know. I just felt like doing this instead. So that vlog will go up tomorrow and then you guys will see all the other stuff after that. Um, so you'll find out in a few vlogs that, uh, we got more snow. <laughs> uh, hi, how you doing, huh? How you doing? Okay, good. Now I see everybody popping in. Dan says, looks good, good, because I can only see what my phone's showing me, so I don't know how good it looks. <laughs> as long as it looks good and sounds good, we are good to go. So, like I said, I thought I would pop in today and do a little live stream. I thought this would be fun. We're, we're testing out the vertical live because this is what YouTube is telling us to do. So, we're going to go ahead and do it and, like I said, see what happens. Because that's what YouTube wants us to do. And I get to do it from my phone, which makes it super easy. I don't have to, like, pull out my computer. Which, by the way, you guys will find this funny. Remember how I bought a new computer? It's still sitting right there. It hasn't moved. It's all set up. It's just sitting right there. So, oh. <gasps> he came to visit for the live stream? I was just going to tell you. That he's there? <laughs> Jamie, say Hi. <laughs> No, he took off. They scared. Oh, he's under. There's one under the Jeep. Squirrel friend is here, guys. There was two squirrel friends. Jamie put peanuts out there. Yeah, he'll come back. Just to see if they would show up for the live streams. Oh, there he goes in front of the Jeep. Oh, uh, as they, oh I couldn't see him. Elnor was in my way. Okay, so well, there's actually two of them around. There was a black one that was just looking in the window. I think he was going for the peanut right here. <laughs> so well they're still out there so they'll come back as long as the dogs yeah, yeah yeah you, you came at the window too fast kira if you would have came yeah, at the window a like, little bit uh, slower yeah <laughs> you kind of spooked him well, and i came up right on the windowsill mom yeah and i'm sure they're out there like oh my gosh there's just like snow and wind that wind is picking up like crazy yeah it's I mean, <laughs> it's starting to come off the trees but... somebody said that's the best thing about a live stream ever to see a squirrel <laughs> Uh, squirrel friend is here. Well, he was here. He was. He'll come. He'll come back. He'll come back. <laughs> we're, we're pretty sure he'll come back. Oh, I forgot to pick up their bowls after I fed it's, them. Uh, it's it's his lunchtime too. So. It is his lunchtime too. Hi Memphis. <laughs> Hi Memphis. <laughs> Would you like to here. say hello to everybody? Hi. It's like, oh my goodness. Are you goofy? What huh? do you think? Goofy. What do you think? It's easier to watch the chat on TV in vertical. Oh, I bet because the oh. chat doesn't go over the screen right, at all. On the side. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. Some of you guys are probably wondering about Memphis's procedure. And uh, you'll find out two vlogs from now. I think Monday's vlog will talk about Memphis's procedure that didn't happen. It didn't mm -hmm. happen. Look, can you guys see her eye? It's gone. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, you can see. It's gone. Mm -hmm. We woke up yesterday and got ready for her procedure. Well, not like, look at her, look at you. She's like, I'm scratching mm -hmm. my head. We woke up yesterday and we checked her eye and it was gone. So we called and canceled her procedure. So Memphis didn't have to have a procedure, which was really nice. Because it's gone. It like disappeared. Should we check for squirrel friend again? I think you spooked him really bad, Kira. I thought he was under my Jeep, but I don't see him out there now. He'll come back. He's got to come back for the peanuts. Yeah, we're glad it's gone too. It's pretty crazy. Um, I should probably properly intro my live stream. The, the neighbor's trying to like walk through all the snow over there. And it's so deep she just had to walk all the way around the corner. <laughs> um, yeah, so I should probably properly start my live stream since we're like four minutes in. If you guys have never joined us on a live stream, basically what we're doing is we're doing a little hangout, a um, little Q&A. You guys can drop questions in the chat. Super chat for questions, things like that, and we'll try to answer questions for you guys and just hang out, hang out with the dogs. Hopefully Squirrel Friend will join us again. <laughs> he can be our special guest today. I also have a husky. Her name is Maya. She's two years old. Do your huskies howl when they want to go outside? Eleanor does. Eleanor definitely howls when she wants to go outside. Yeah, somebody said, I saw in the forecast we got snow. We did. It quit snowing. 
it's it's starting to get windy out there. And it is actually blowing around. I didn't think it, it was is. blow around as much, but whatever's falling out of the trees is definitely blowing around. I was sitting in the office working, and that big, I think that was when I yelled down to you that the wind was here. Yeah. That big wind gust threw all the snow from the tree next to my window to the window. Yeah. And it scared me. <laughs> Eleanor, can you do the woos? She's like, I am looking for Squirrel Friend, you guys. Squirrel Friend was here. I saw him. He will return. No, the dogs have not had a bath yet this year. I'm in Colorado. We didn't get snow. Oh, we're in northern Michigan. We got snow. And apparently it's supposed to snow for the next two days, but I don't think it's supposed to snow a lot. Yeah, not much. Mm. It'll probably just blow around a lot. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Um, I don't think I linked in the video description. I may have. It's in the Beacons link. All of the events that we're coming to this year, those are down down in the video description. If you click the Beacons link, down at the bottom of that is a link to all of the events that we will be going to. <laughs> Same here, too. We got enough snow to pretty much cover everything. Yeah, we, uh, oh, Memphis is coming to look for Squirrel Friend. You gonna, you gonna go see if he's out there? I don't know. I think Kira scared him pretty good. <laughs> Some of them are not scared of the dogs at all, and some of them are very scared of the well, dogs. I think there was a person walking by the driveway at the there same was. time. Yeah. The dog spooked him, so yeah. Yeah. The other day, I got. Uh, <gasps> he's back. Out. He's back, Jamie. He's back. He's back. He's right here. He's right here. Is he eating his peanut? Is a big old gray squirrel? He's back. Here comes Eleanor. Don't scare him. <gasps> you got one peanut, dude. You don't have to eat them all. Stop. Stop it. <laughs> We're trying to watch Squirrel Friend. This has now gone from Gone to the Snow Dogs live stream to Squirrel Friend live stream. What should we name him? That's the gray one. He got he got that peanut. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. He's coming back. He's coming back. I see him. I see him. If you put your big head in the way, we can't see the squirrel. There he goes. There he goes. He's going across the yard. There he goes. He's going to go up the tree. And there he goes across the yard. Oh, my goodness. Okay, that was the cutest thing in the world. <laughs> Do you have the live stream open? Oh, uh, yeah. Does it look clear at least? Uh, yeah. Okay, good. Eleanor's like, watch me bounce. I can bounce just like the squirrel. Did you see me, guys? Oh, my gosh. I didn't I didn't expect squirrel. Those peanuts have been out there for a while. I didn't no, expect. I, put them out today. I know, but, like, he oh, hasn't yeah. been here today. Yeah, no. So I'm like. I might have checked this morning, but there weren't no peanuts. Yeah, I didn't know if he was going to come for peanuts or not. They check in the morning. Uh, they at, do check in the morning. At sunrise, and then they'll come back an uh, hour before sunset. Oh, somebody says we should name him Scrat from Ice Age. Oh, he must be back. Look at Eleanor's face. <laughs> Where's he at? Is he in the tree? You, you, look, you looked away. <laughs> streakers? <laughs> we can name the squirrel Streakers. And we could bet $20,000 that he'll be streakering across the, across the yard. <laughs> Which husky said sheds the most? Yes. <laughs> the answer to that is yes. Uh, hello from Canada. We'll be in Canada in like a month and a half. And then we'll be in Canada again in like two and a half months. Oh my gosh. So many Canada trips. Hi from New York. Stripers. We can't name them Stripers because that's the cat that Dan and Crystal might total. They're totally not keeping that cat. Totally, totally not keeping Stripers. But we can't steal that name. That's that cat's name. <laughs> so I have recently got into rock tumbling and I'm wondering if you have any tips and tricks for tumbling. Did you get a tumbler, like the rolly tumbler, or did you get like the vibratory tumbler? The one that like, one of them like rolls them like this and one of them like shakes them like that. Which kind did you get? Because if you got the rolly one, it's going to make your, your rocks more round. If you got the other one, the rocks will maintain their shapes a little bit more. And I highly recommend using the ceramic, starting off with the ceramic bits instead of the sand. It's actually been said to work a lot better. Don't quote me on that. I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> but we plan on it pretty soon. Pretty soon, pretty soon. Oh, somebody asked about the dog's names. That one there with her head facing the other way, the dark colored one here, that's Eleanor. The one back there is Kira. And then the one over here is Miss Memphis. This is our little tap, tippy tappy girl Memphis. Oh, the sun came out just for you, Memphis. Hello from Ohio. Hello from Louisiana. Hi from Michigan. Hi from Wisconsin. Wisconsin. You guys got snow over there in Wisconsin? I heard that Wisconsin and um, uh, Minnesota don't have that much snow either. Aunt Peggy, I have the Bionic Memphis and have ordered the Kira plushie. Woo! -hoo! Oh man, the sun is like gonna come out and make everything super bright. 
There's only seven days left to order the Kira plushie if you guys haven't got it yet. I did pin the link to the top of the chat. So uh, if you haven't done that. And thank you for your member super chat, by the way. Yeah, if you haven't done that yet, um, you should do that. And if you guys are members, a members only vlog went up yesterday. And it was all about rocks. Because we like rocks. Hi from Pennsylvania. Hey from Illinois. Southeast Wisconsin got three inches. Oh, okay. So you guys did get a little bit of snow. I was looking at the um, weather for the first expo we're doing is in two weeks, less than two weeks from today we leave. Uh, and I was looking at the weather and it looks like it's going to be in the 50s in New Jersey. So that should be pretty nice. I'm hoping that that, that should be pretty nice. I heard mine. I don't want to miss it this time around. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh. The future's so bright. <laughs> The, it is, the snow is very wet and heavy here today. It's uh, like 32 degrees outside, so it's that wet, heavy snow. I was going to live stream and take you guys out in the yard so the dogs could play in the snow, but um, it got really windy, so I didn't think you guys would be able to hear us. So I thought, well, we'll just stay inside. I'm making my boyfriend take me to the expo in Mississauga. Awesome. That's what... A month and a half away. Whoa, Memphis here. Hold on, let me let me get the sun out of your eyes. How's that? I have a rolling rock tumbler. It's one of the rock tumblers I got for my birthday. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, you know, just follow the instructions. Watch a lot of YouTube videos on it. That'll definitely help. Are you taking the RV to the expos? Not to the ones in March because you just never know about the weather. So not to the ones in March. I'm blocking the sun from Memphis because it. Look, it. It's if I move, it's like. Whoa. Oh, the phone blocked it, too. I'll protect your eyeballs, sweetheart. I will totally protect your eyeballs. Yeah, we're going to New Jersey. We're going to Edison, New Jersey. We're going to Chantilly, Virginia. We're going to Toronto slash Mississauga, Ontario. And then we're going to Victoria, British Columbia. And then in December, we're going to Novi, Michigan. Will you have a walk? We're... Trying to figure that out if we're going to do a Washington meetup. I need to find a place to possibly host it. I'm not... I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. We'll see. Do you want to go rock climbing? No. No, I do not want to go rock climbing. Also, I don't know how long we're going to be... Heidi, welcome to the member to the memberships. Um, what was I going to say? I don't know how long we're staying in British Columbia, but... I'm pretty sure we're going to have to go up to Vancouver, and we might stay there for a little bit, like maybe a couple of days, because uh, my friends from Huskies and the Hatch are up there, and she sent me a bunch of places that they want to take us, and I thought, you know, we're all the way on that side of the country. We should probably do something really cool. They, we have not been invited back to the Hershey show, so I don't know if we'll be in Hershey or not. I'm in Vancouver, Washington. Come here. It's beautiful. We can't come everywhere. We're coming to Victoria in Canada. <laughs> I wish we could come everywhere, but, you know, sometimes it's difficult. It costs a lot of, it costs a lot of money to drive all the way across the country. Uh, I saw you in Nova this past December. What does this say? Wait, hold on. Wait, stop going so fast. Yes, I remember you, Dale. Wave New Jersey hello for me when you get there. Oh, that's so cool. Sleepy Memphis. Uh, we don't normally take the dogs down to Texas, you know, mainly because it can get really hot in Texas. But if there's a pet expo down there and you want us to come to Texas, reach out to your local pet expo. Some of you guys reached out to the Super Pet Expo, and that's the entire reason we're coming to New Jersey and Virginia. is because enough of you reached out to them for them to be like, wait, who the heck are these people? And then the guy that runs it reached out to me, and then he reached out to the other pet expo owners, like the people from Novi and the people from Canada. Oh no, Kira, I know what you're doing. I'll, I'll stand over here. And um, <laughs> that's the whole reason we're coming. Oh, don't miss the super chats. Leo, thank you for the super chat. What do you think is the best size crate for a Husky? He's 40 pounds and right now I have him in a 36 inch crate. That's probably big enough. You don't want it to be too big. So that's probably a good size. That's what size we used for our dogs. Rosa says, so my friend Kim can't see you in Virginia. Oh, so she wanted to go to New Jersey and wanted company. So I'm going to see you in both New Jersey and Virginia. Yay! Not like she had to twist my arm. Oh, Rosa, I'm so excited we get to see you again. Yay! How old is Memphis? She will be 11 on April the 4th. April the 4th. Speaking of, Kira will be 5 on March the 13th. Or are you trying to get the... 
Oh, there it is. She's distracted though. Kira, it's over here. It's right there. Kira, it Kira, it's right here. Kira. She's like, no. I didn't realize that the sun was going to come out. <laughs> uh, hello from Berlin. Oh my goodness. Thank you for making videos. You made my childhood. Aw, you're welcome. Thank you. Aunt Peggy! Thank you for the super chat. Oh, I forgot I can heart super chats. Can I heart all of them? Oh, it's doing the thing where it doesn't want me to do the things. Nick! Great news about Memphis. Looking forward to the New Jersey Pet Expo. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to see you again, Nick. Yeah, we were, uh, Jamie said he looked the other day and it was pretty much gone. And then we looked that morning and it was gone. We don't know if she rubbed it off or if the turkey tail mushroom that we've been giving her helped out. We're not really sure what did it, but I sent all the pictures to the vet and they were like, you can get the laser out if you want, but they, they run so hard at each other yeah. with that. Yeah, Eleanor's Yeah. <laughs> I have a husky now and I'm new to this. So any advice, good luck. <laughs> you're new to having a husky and you're looking for advice. What kind of, what kind of, okay. What advice would you give to a brand new husky owner? Do you remember when we were first time husky owners and had never owned a dog before? Make sure you have a leash and a collar. Leash and a brush. collar. Brushes. Lots of brushes. Patience. Make sure you have lots of patience. Bye, Memphis. You're wandering into the dark hallway. I'm down here, honey. <laughs> this is like, oh, mama's down here. I cut Eleanor's nails just before this, and then Kira was like, what are you doing in there? So I grabbed her real quick, and I took her in the office, and I cut her nails real quick, and I have to say, Eleanor is a nightmare to have her nails cut. Dan says, I say learn from the videos on the channel. There is a lot of videos over on our other channel at youtube.com slash gone to the snow dogs, which is our main YouTube channel. I don't know why I say it's our main YouTube channel, because we upload far less over there. But anyway, you guys get what I'm saying. Um, there is a lot of good information and good videos over there. For information on being a husky owner i will probably oh i missed it i will probably see you guys in either chantilly or edison i am so excited that we're coming over there i'm hoping to meet lots of new people what are you doing what are you doing what are you, are you picking on your sister don't pick on this sister this sister might kick your butt <laughs> uh, new to a double coated dog strong vacuum oh yeah a very high quality vacuum cleaner is a must when you have a double coated dog. What phone do you use? The phone I am currently using is the Google Pixel 8 Pro. Jamie has my old Google Pixel 7 Pro with the beautiful curved glass. You knew I was gonna say it, didn't you? <gasps> what happened? What happened, huh? What happened? Did I get the other one? Kevin! Kevin, thank you for the super chat! Hello Jess, Jamie, Memphis, Kira, and Eleanor. Hi, how are you? How are you? There's 400 of you guys here? Holy cow! Where'd you all come from? Sound off in the chat! Where'd you come from? <laughs> uh, sorry, Dan, but this phone does better live streams than your phone. Okay, so to be fair, when Dan live streams from his phone, a lot of the times he's live streaming um, on Wi-Fi. I, or not Wi-Fi, on um, like the 5G, and right now I'm live streaming on Wi-Fi, so that also does make a difference. And... I mean, I'm not trying to defend Dan's Crapple phone, but, I mean, Apple phone, but Dan's phone also isn't a pro, so the camera on it is a little bit different, if that makes sense. Your audio is crackly, and you have a screen tear. My audio is crackly. Well, you know. I don't have a screen crack on this phone. <laughs> uh. That's a lot of people. Yeah, there's a, I'm telling you, vertical live streaming is a way to go. Hello from the Poconos. Those are mountains, right? Oh, are you smushing? It's hard to it's hard to watch the dog. That's how I think she got that thing off her eye. <laughs> I do, because remember she was doing it the other day on the bed, and she was all squishing her face, and we were. She gets that all the time. I know, but I bet that's how she got it out of her eye. Oh, I'm sorry, did I stop? She's like, why did you stop? Why did you stop? Where's Dan? He's in the chat. What's Eleanor's favorite toy? Yes. Eleanor likes all the toys. All of them. Snuggles from Memphis are the best. Snuggles from Memphis are 100% the best. 100%. Yeah, please don't do it. I'll let you if you want. She's like, I'm thinking about it. Thinking about it, Dad. I'm thinking about jumping. She's like, I don't know, but I'm thinking about it. Uh-oh. Boom. 
Water. Nope. Your spot? You going for your spot or you going for water? You already ate. You you already ate. Oh yeah, that's a good question. Is there anybody here that doesn't know who we are? That's not that's here for the first time. That's here for the first time. Whoa. Whoa, there's the reflection. There it is, Kira. Get it. Oh, here comes Eleanor. Watch out. Kira loves reflections. She's like, I'm going for the reflections. Me. Oh, there is some people that are here that are new and have never been here before. That's awesome. Well, if you like dogs and you like travel and you like, you know, dogs, <laughs> uh, you should definitely uh, subscribe to the channel. We upload four videos a week normally. Once in a while we go live instead of that. Uh, so normally we upload four vlogs a week. And it's mostly centered around, I mean, who am I kidding? It's 100% centered around the dogs. And sometimes the stuff we do as well. And the stuff that we do with the dogs. And then we have another channel that's all dogs all the time. I honestly think, oh, hi, hello, hi. I've been here for years since they've had Oakley and Shelby. That's pretty cool. I just subbed. Well, welcome to the audience. When you hear me say that, that's what we call you. You're not the audience. You're the audience. <laughs> Eleanor's right there. She's right there. Dan will be in New Jersey. So will we. <laughs> uh, I learned about you guys from Nerdish by Nature. I still talk to Sarah and Yura. I really, I really would love to see them again. They were such great people. Uh, well, oh, my goodness. Miss Kira. Oh. Oh, oh, something made a... What's making that one? Uh, oh, it's the fan. Uh, I've been here since Shiloh. Can you, can you introduce them? Can you introduce them? The dogs? Yes. Uh, in case you guys are new here and you do not know, this is our youngest. This is Eleanor. She's two years old no and she's no um, still a puppy. No wider. Dad is not chewable, ma'am. Not chewable. And then that one over there, that is Miss Kira. She is our ice princess. She actually has a limited edition plushie that is for sale right now for seven more days. And uh, she, um, she, I was trying to remember, did I say how old she was? She's five years old, if I didn't say that. Kira is five years old. And then this one over here, this is our little snuggle buggle. This is Memphis. Miss Memphis Bell, do you see yourself in the, is that what you, are you looking at yourself? It's like, whoa, who's that pretty dog in the reflection? That's you, sweetheart. That's you. And Memphis is 11. Well, technically, so technically Memphis is 10 and technically Ellen, or Eleanor, and technically Kira is 4. But Kira turns 5 on March 13th and Memphis turns 11 on April 4th. So they're both close enough to their birthdays, I guess. <laughs> Hi, Di! Uh... If I could, I would lay all day and snuggle with Memphis. You know what? It's the greatest thing ever. Holy cow, did we just hit 500 viewers? Oh my gosh. Sound off in the chat. Where are you guys watching from? I want to know where everybody's from. This is going to be insane. I'll try to read as many of them as I can. But sound off in the chat. I want to know where you're watching from. Or maybe where you found us from. Uh, you know, that'd be fun too. <laughs> Sweden? Oh my goodness. I told Jessica that a lot of our viewers are on that side of the ocean. There's a Denmark one. Hawaii? Yeah. New Jersey. See you soon. Toronto. We're coming to Toronto. Oh, I said it wrong. We're coming to Toronto. Uh, is that dog in your face? I see a couple Michigans. I see some New Yorks. Ohio, Kentucky, Texas, South Yorkshire, Canada, New Jersey. We're coming to New Jersey as well. Oh my God, Ludington, Michigan. I heard they're closing Ludington State Park. Yeah, they are for a, for a year for remodels. Yeah. Germany, I'm Scotland, Philadelphia, New York, Here's Florida. Hawaii, oh my God, Germany, this is way too much fun. <laughs> Russia, holy cow. Germany, France, Kansas. Oh, I'm sorry, that's probably annoying, isn't it? I can, I can unplug so, that. Right. Australia. And then I get a what? What do you mean, BRM bug? <laughs> so a lot less people on the east, west coast. Yeah. No, there's uh, people from the west coast. I see like... Indiana, Ireland, France. Oh my one goodness. One person say California. I found you guys on YouTube. Couple Arizonas. Texas. 
I saw a couple Texases. Texases. I'm from everywhere now. I live in Michigan, England, Illinois. Oh my gosh. Okay, so next question. Uh, this would be for anybody that's new, because most of you that have been here for a while have answered this for me many times. But any, oh, I found you guys on YouTube and TikTok. We are on the Tiki Talks. The moon. I'm from there. <laughs> the moon. The moon. Um, so this is for anybody that's new. Anybody that's here that's mm. new that has never uh, that has never been around before has really has no idea who we are. Maybe found us. How did you find us? Were you scrolling through your shorts feed and our live stream popped up? India. Um, I would like to know how you guys found us because there it definitely. I think that would be really cool. Hold on a second. I have to. Boop. Okay. Um. Oh, hopefully I did that right. Sure did. Good job. Um, scrolling through live streams. Yep. Okay. So apparently YouTube is doing this new thing where if you live stream vertically, they're putting you in this new live stream area, shorts and TikTok. They're putting you in this new like live stream area where you can scroll through and live streams will pop up. So that was something we thought we would test today because why the heck not? I might actually do, so I'm going live on our other YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash gone to the snow dogs i'm going live there on saturday with the dogs to do like a big q a and all that as well so maybe maybe i'll just do it like this instead of hooking up my computer <laughs> i found you when i was dealing with really bad panic attacks and ptsd your videos have helped me so much i love you virtual hugs they're being crazy <laughs> I found you guys on YouTube. Wow. It is ridiculously windy. I'm kind of glad the clouds came back, so, though, so the... Whee! Uh-oh. Are you going to get puppy zoomies? Puppy zoomies! Oh, is it that time? It is 27 minutes in. What do you guys think it's time for? Also, if you guys want to become members, there's a few new uh, members members vlogs that have gone up recently so you can check those out don't feel like you have to but it definitely helps us out sing eleanor sing okay everybody here's your warning it might get loud sing 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 eleanor sing no. Gotta hit them high notes, you do it. sing eleanor sing <laughs> yeah. yeah you want to sing Shake it off. Okay, sing. Yeah. Show us that pretty voice. Sing. Sing. I can hear it through the fireplace. Memphis is like, no thanks, I don't want yeah, to sing today. <laughs> we got a little bit of the woos. We got a little bit of the woos. We'll take a little bit. We'll take a little bit. Monkey see, monkey do. That's how the singing starts. You're going to start a howl. That's that's pretty much how it starts. You're going to start a howl. Somebody wants Jamie to play his guitar. It's downstairs. Wait, they want you to play your guitar, Jamie. I, we play it for me? Give, give me one of them little lap harps and I'll go play A little lap? A mouth harp? Yeah, yeah a lap harp. <laughs> a, lap har a lap harp would be much larger than a mouth harp. Yeah, yeah. Oh, mouth harp. Uh, Actually, I think we have one. Uh, we had one somewhere. The wind, the wind filled in for... Uh, yeah. The dogs are all doing great. I am going to set this down for a second and I'm going to... I don't know if you guys can actually hear it or not, but I'm going to unplug this water fountain because it's making noise. We, we use filtered water fountains for the dogs, but you can see this one is half empty, so it, it makes noise until we fill it. And you guys might not have been able to hear it, but I could, and it was driving me nuts. It makes waterfall noise. It does make waterfall noise. Amanda! Oh, my goodness. Where did you find... Oh, the Care Bear dog toys? These? Let's see. Care Bear Maybe dog toys? Can I can I show them your Care Bear dog toy? This one is Kira's. That's Kira's Care Bear dog toy. That uh, is Kira's Care Bear. That's Kira's. Uh, I found them at Petco. No, oh. PetSmart. PetSmart. They had them at PetSmart. 
I have a pink one. There's a orange one. And there's the green one. I'm like, there was a green one. I knew there were somewhere. Dun, 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 dun. Yes. Um, uh, what, what, what? Uh, Kira has a birthday coming up. We have a P.O. box listed down in our video description below. And every year we put up posts for the dog's birthday. So Kira has a birthday coming up on March 13th. And Memphis has one coming up on April 4th. And we do birthday videos. And if you guys want to send cards or birthday gifts or whatever to the dogs, I put a post up on our community page with all the information if you're interested in it. Uh, I'll, I gotta do another one soon and then we'll do like a video where she opens all of her gifts and that'll be oh hi Memphis that'll be up be on bad, oh is that what happened um, that'll be more that'll be up over on gone to the snow dogs so Here, I'll help you. I oh is she looking for a toy it's like I am looking oh oh yeah oh because I couldn't close it that was why it's broken it's you're the one that's always been able to fix it, and I, I couldn't fix it. I should probably buy a new one and throw that one away. Because we need we need a new one. I really hate that Facebook makes you guys film vertically. I can't stand watching vertical. Um, we're not on Facebook. We're on we're on YouTube. I love vertical video, and I love vertical video because I don't have to like I I watch a lot of stuff on my phone, and you'd be surprised on YouTube now. It's like mostly on your phone and on television. I was surprised how many people we have that watch us on TV. It used to be mobile phone, like mobile mobile was up at the top, and then like your desktop slash laptops were secondary. But now it's mostly mobile and television, and then computers which is really interesting to me. And the nice thing is, since so many people watch on mobile, like on their phones or their tablets, you just turn it sideways and you can easily see it. And I guess on the TV, which I haven't seen yet, the chat's over on the side. So yeah, it's smaller on the TV, but the chat's not like covering everything up. So I thought that was kind of cool. Oh my goodness. They don't want to play with me. No, they don't want to play with you. They always want to play with each other. Um, me, 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 me. <laughs> uh, do you want to go grab Kira's plushie off my desk so I can, or here, watch this. Entertain yeah. the masses. That's my hand. And don't knock my phone over. <laughs> squeak it, squeak it. And I'm like, where's your mama? Yeah, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. This is the one they're not allowed to chew on, though. Can't chew on, can't chew on your sister. It doesn't have no squeaker in it. You don't want it. So, like, you don't know. I totally want that. Dun, da, da, da. So, as I said, there is a link pinned at the top here. This is the limited edition Kira plushie with the removable apple, uh, frozen apple. Because Kira, like, wow, we're over five. We're over, we're over 500. Um... Anyway, this is the limited edition Kira plushie. There's a link up in the top of the chat if you guys are interested in getting one of these. There is only seven days left to get one. So if you want to get one, you should totally should. Look at this. even got her little pink nose. Uh -huh. How are the mom and the dog and the two puppies doing that we help transport? They're actually doing amazing. The little boy got named Wizard or Merlin because he's a little wizard and he likes to pee on everything because he's a boy puppy. <laughs> but uh, they're actually doing really good. I think a couple of them have pending adoptions already, which is crazy. So, yeah. I have a Memphis plushie! Yay! What's the most you've had in a live stream? Um, probably the 514 that was on here just a few minutes ago. That's my arm. Oh, you're gonna intervene? Well, that's not fair. Hey, hey, hey. hey. Be careful. You can't. Oh. Yeah, you can't do that while she's playing with Dad. That's not nice, Kira. I've been here since the beginning. That's awesome. Uh, yeah, they named him. We, we nicknamed that boy dog Mer, Wizzle, Wizzer because he peed on everything. And then we're like, that's an inappropriate name. So then they changed it to Merlin because he's a wizard. <laughs> we thought that was funny. Yeah, we dropped off the puppies to my friend Kevin, who might be in the chat. I don't know if he is or not. He might be at work, Give though. Me toy. Where's your toy? 
How are the dog and cat you were pet sitting for? They're good, and my neighbor is back home, so she's doing really good. Jamie actually went over there. Oh, there's some tippy tappies. Jamie actually went over and plowed her driveway for her today, and we've been helping her, you know, bring stuff into the house and do stuff like that. Hello, I've only just got into your live. I've missed so much. Well, welcome to the live. <laughs> Who's here? Where's the squirrel? Kira's like, I'll go look for the squirrel. Right. <laughs> oh, we're over 500 again. My goodness. My goodness. Oh, got it. She's like, I got it. I got it. She knows drop it. See? She knows it. She's like, I wanted to jump out of you, Dad. <laughs> She's like, watch this trick. And she hits yeah, you in the gut. Right. She uh. thought about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you win. You yes, win uh, Memphis, the fluffy land cloud does do does do uh, the tippy tappies when the other dogs play. Oh, I see Cyber Husky in here. People ask me if I named Drizzle because he peed a lot as a puppy. <laughs> uh, that's funny. At what age did you get your dogs? Memphis was nine weeks old. Kira was nine weeks old. Nine weeks old, and Eleanor was nine weeks old as well. I think. I think they were all nine weeks old. Oh my gosh! I've watched you since I was four. That's amazing. I have a dog, and he's a Jack Russell mixed with a pug. Yes, Dan made the comment. You can find all of the facts. There is a FAQ, I believe, in the video description below. Or there might not be, but there's supposed to be. Is there a reason you have all girl dogs? People love to ask this question. The biggest reason that I have all girl dogs is... Uh, They're smaller. That I was going to say that. I you stole, stole my answer. <laughs> Will you pour me a little glass of soda, please? Um... So, yes, like Jamie said, the real answer is they're smaller. So I grew up with St. Bernard's. And Mom and Dad, if you're watching, I love you guys, and I seriously don't know how you did it your whole lives. But I grew up with St. Bernard's, and St. Bernard's are gigantic. And one of the things, when something happens to your dog, you got to be able to, like, pick them up and take them, you know, to the vet or whatever needs to be done. If you're out somewhere and something happens, you got to be able to carry them. So one of the things I learned from when I was younger was I... I always thought I would own St. Bernard's, but I never wanted to have a dog that I could not pick up on my own. Kim says, Saturday I broke my right ankle, so I'm in bed. Oh my gosh, Kim, that is crazy. I hope you feel better soon. So anyway, um, one of the things that I learned when I was younger is that I always wanted to be able to pick up a dog on my own. Now, yes, I have Jamie, and 99% of the time we're together with the dogs, but for those times when he's not around, I always wanted to be able to be able to pick up the dog if something were to happen. And there have been times when Jamie hasn't been home or hasn't been around, and I've had to pick up the dogs by myself. Are you getting an ice cube? <laughs> so that was one of the thing, one of the reasons that I liked the idea of females is because they are actually smaller. Eleanor weighs 42.5 pounds. Kira weighs 42 pounds. And Miss Memphis over here weighs 53 pounds. And I can pick them all up by myself when I have to. Mm, I had to get a drink too. Not you, ma'am. No, that is not for you. You won't like it. It's got bubbles. You won't like it. It's got bubbles in it. She's so like, I don't know. I might like it. I might like it. Oh, here's the the Kira plushy yesy look. See, the little frozen apple comes off. And I don't know if I, I'm pretty sure I showed you guys this already, but it's got the little blue little blue paw pads i still haven't figured out what i'm doing for the next eleanor design we'll figure i gotta i gotta figure that out that's one more one more thing to add to the list <laughs> one more thing to add to the list of things to do any the any chance you wait any chance you and ella get a private trick lessons from the super collies moms at one of the conventions so it's funny that you asked that jim my friend uh i don't know if you're going to toronto no, it's not that far from where you are either, Jim. Uh, it sounds like when we go to Toronto, Sarah will be there. And she's doing trick training classes. And I already told her to save me a spot. So we're going to try to figure it out. <gasps> Kira's got her little... Don't steal Kira's ghost toy! Oh, Ma'am. 
That's not yours. That's Kira's. Rosa says, does Eleanor know any more new tricks? The last time you showed the stuff, it was crawling and sit pretty. She does. Um, Jamie, do you want to... Do you, the last time the spot was at like 7 a.m. Yes, Dan, but you know what? We're doing it. We're going to do it because, because I really want to support Sarah. If you guys don't know who Sarah is from the Super Collies and you're looking for another dog account to follow, they're mainly on Instagram, but it's uh, Sarah Carson, celebrity dog trainer Sarah Carson, and then her other account is the Super Collies. You guys should definitely go follow her because she's amazing and she's a great friend. I've known her since she was like, I don't know, 14. I've known her for so long. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's a good friend of mine. Every once in a while, you guys will see her in the videos when we go to the expos. I was too cheap to get my enhanced license. I was too cheap to get, you can still get your enhanced license, Jim. Go do it now, just go upgrade it. It won't be that hard. Come to Canada, come hang out with us. For, from you, I think it's only like four hours away. And if you've never been, you need to experience Toronto. Just remember that during Easter weekend in Toronto, everything closes on Friday, which nobody informed us of the last time we were there, but now we're prepared. Oh, Eleanor dog tricks. I can't really get her to do the tricks while the other dogs are in here, though. I might be able to. You can try. That's Kira's toy. I just don't want her to break it. Oh my gosh, I love Sarah Carson. She's so amazing! Yes. I thought Sarah and Ella... Ella and you would be a great block. Yeah. Oh, she did. She did a paw. She's doing it for. She's doing it for Jamie. Oh, get her to wave. Oh, that's a pretty good sit. Pretty. But you gotta learn your commands. Can you sit pretty? Yeah. Oh, that was so good. She lost her balance a little bit. She went overboard a little bit. She, see if you can get her to bow. Bow. You gotta go all the way down. No, she's supposed to be standing when she bows. Good girl. Oh, there sit, you go. Sit, sit. If you're gonna sit. give me your paw. Yeah. Now do high five. Now high five. Yes. No. Okay, now while she's standing, now go get her to bow. You bow. Bow. You bow. She might not do it because it's a toy. Bow. Eleanor, bow. Yes! Look at that bow! Good girl! Oh, you good give her girl. all them snuggles. Oh my goodness, that was so good. Sorry, hon, I think she listened to my voice over yours. <laughs> but she did it. Yep. Uh, in an upcoming vlog, we're showing off some of her stuff. So, Dan and Jess, when you come to New Jersey, can I get autographs on something, please? Oh, you sure can. If you want to bring, if any of you guys that are here are coming to any of the events and you want to bring anything for us to autograph or autograph i will be bringing the dog's paw print stamps again you 100 percent are more than welcome to bring stuff for us to sign and i don't want to ruin the surprise but there might be a second version of a poster that's behind jamie's head that might be at some of the you got some dog hair in your face there sweetheart uh there might be a second version of that poster that might have some other dogs on it that's going to get released at some of these events and then once the events are done i'll release them on um Etsy as well. So yes, if you guys would like anything signed by us at any of the events, always, always, we love to sign anything. We've signed hoodies. I, I still think my favorite thing that I signed was, and I, I'm so sorry, I forgot her name, but I believe it was, it was at Novi. She brought a canvas that had the artwork of the dogs where it's Shiloh, Shelby, and Oakley, and they have like the wings above them. And then it's Memphis and Kira underneath it. It's so pretty. I got to photograph that, and that's actually getting updated as well. I should have gotten Memphis photograph on her pillow cover. Oh, well, Jim, we'll see you again. Bring it with you to Novi. Bring it with you to Novi. What are their names? Well, this, oh my goodness, what do we have over here? Breaking news, everybody. Today is going to be a good day, and how do we know today is going to be a good day? Today is going to be a good day because the bellies are up. When the bellies are up, you know it's a good day. Okay, back to the dog's names. This over here is Memphis. She will be turning 11 on April the 4th. That one over there that is now begging for her other toy is Kira. She will be turning 5 on March 13th. And then this little girl here who decided to come get in my face is Miss Eleanor with her two different colored eyeballs. And she just turned 2 years old in November. So there's the introduction to the dogs. The be they are. Them bellies are up. You see them over there? There they are. Bellies up. She's like, I got my bellies in the air, cause it's gonna be a good day. 
So, oh, wait, I saw something else about Toronto. Jess, can I bring you and Jamie some Canadian snacks to the Toronto Expo? Yes, 100%. We love snacks. We love Timbits. Jamie likes coffee. Um, yes, the answer is yes. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you guys can always bring us stuff to the events. We love that stuff. We have a P.O. box as well, and you can always mail us stuff as well, but I know that shipping is ridiculous. So if you have the chance to meet us in person to bring us stuff, that's even more amazing. Memphis is posing. She totally is. What are their full names? Memphis is Memphis Bell. She's actually Highlander's Memphis Bell. Kira's name, I got to remember these. Kira's name is... Uh, Kira. <laughs> it's Kira. Ninkasi's empress kira kira is an empress she's actually named after the empress kira from the movie the dark crystal jade welcome to the pack and then eleanor is braylon's eleanor the enchantress so those two over there kind of have like those it you know enchantress and en empress and then memphis is memphis bell because <laughs> because she's a little southern bell and she's the sweetest darn thing on the planet sweetest darn thing on the planet Oh, for a second, I thought that was my brother until I remembered that my brother's downstate. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's not my brother. Oh, somebody's brakes are squeaking. What is the... Wait, whoa, hold on. What? It, where is the orange one? Uh, Shelby, Shelby passed away in 2019. Please don't break Kira's ball. Thanks. Yeah, for those of you that are new or may have been around for a while and may not have seen us in a while... Um, we have had a total of six Huskies while we've been doing YouTube. Actually, if you look at that poster over there, let's see if I can do this. That's Shiloh. She passed away in 2013. Oh, it's going to focus on my finger. Let's see if I can do it this way. That's Oakley. She passed away in 2018. And then that's Shelby, and she passed away in 2019. And then Memphis is on there, too. But Memphis is also right here. <laughs> uh. I know a lot of people ask about the dogs. Some of you guys find us through, like, older videos, and then you find the new videos, and then you're confused because the dogs are different. So I get asked literally daily what happened to the other dogs. And, you know, it used to bother me, but I've, I've come to the realization that a lot of you guys have found us from old videos because YouTube loves to promote our older videos and then push our newer videos to you guys. So I get it. I understand why. Oh, here's an even better way to do this. Let's go no, down I was gonna, I was the line of dogs. Say, is how many They're not, people have watched the video and does that annoy them that it's not in order? I know, it's not in the right order. I, we can fix it. We can. So this was our first Husky Shiloh. Um, she, was, she was the sweetest the sweetest thing on the planet. They're technically not in the right order, though, because that's not our second Husky. This was our second Husky. Her name was Shelby. And then this was our third Husky. She was our rescue. Her name was Oakley. We got her when she was... Esti estimated to be somewhere between the ages of six and eight years old. We only had her for six years before she passed away, but she was probably around 14 when she passed away. And then this was our fourth Husky, which is Miss Memphis, which you've seen. She's here. This is our fifth Husky. This is Kira. That's like a puppy image of Kira. And then there's Miss Eleanor, and she's here too. And if you're wondering where we got that art from, that art was from Shalman Portraits. And one of these days, I will also hang up the other one I have of Eleanor for up here. I have it. I really do. I swear. I swear I'll hang it up one of these days. Put it on the list of things. On the list of things. Yes, Eleanor's from Colorado. Memphis is from Michigan. Uh, Eleanor's from Colorado. And Kira's from Jersey. That's where she gets her attitude from. She's a Hi, Kira. She's a Jersey girl. And part cat, as if you can't tell. She's like, this is my spot. I lay up here so I can so I can overlook everything that's going on. <laughs> you like this spot too? Memphis is like, um, excuse me, Dad. You might you might want to. Where are you going? Nope. You're gonna sit and you're gonna yell. You all right? Oh, you got an itch. Oh, we get it. She's like, I got an itch in my ear right here. <laughs> Got an itch in my ear right here. I was just scrolling through and I found this beautiful stream of dogs. They're beautiful. Well, welcome to our live stream. If you like dogs, we upload four videos a week on this channel of our daily adventures and daily lives with these dogs. So, you know, you could totally subscribe and hang around and see all the rest of the fun stuff we do. Or not. <laughs> yes, that is cat dog 
Cat dog. Cat, what are you doing? I was singing the cat dog song. Are you going to lay down on... Ooh, you going to fluff it? Fluff it, Memphis! Fluff it! Squish your face in it! Fluff it! Squish it! Oh, yeah, squish it! Every time I say fluff it and squish it, I think of the bop it game. <laughs> bop it! <laughs> twist it! Pull it! Turn it! <laughs> Yeah, that's what I think of every time. <laughs> oh, Memphis. That is Eleanor's bed. Ah, <laughs> Memphis, no. What? She normally drinks from the flowing water. Oh, so she no. Where the flowing water is, it was just dry. She's like, huh? Oh, I'm sorry. You want me to plug it back in? It's broke, Mom. She's like, Mom, I wanted the fresh water that flows out of the top. No, oh, you're right. She does. She normally drinks, she out, normally of the, drinks in that out of the top. What are you doing? Are you defluffering it? Uh-oh. Don't eat it. How is Memphis's eye? It's great. Her lump's gone, and she didn't end up having to go have her little procedure done, which was awesome. Dan and Crystal got another cat. They didn't get another cat. They're taking care of an outside cat. Hi, Memphis, but they're totally not going to keep stripers. Who wants to make a bet that they're totally going to keep that cat? Because I would totally bet that they're going to keep that cat. I'm just saying. Because Dan and Crystal are suckers. Just like us. <laughs> get up there, Memphis. Go up there next to Dad. Come on. He says you can get in your spot. Come here. Ready? Ready? Go. There you go. Sometimes she just needs that extra encouragement. You got it? She's like, and right she's like, I gotta get my butt right there, and then, and there you go, there you go. Hi, cat dog, how you doing? How you doing, huh? I see that face. Mm -hmm. She's like, hmm. Oh yeah, I gotta make sure nobody drinks mine. <laughs> uh, Eleanor, what you got? What you got, huh? You got that good toy? Oh yeah, there's lots of snow outside. Dan said on his breakfast dream that Stripers is not going back outside. Oh, did he? He said that on his breakfast dream today. He told me yesterday, 10 cats is a lot. And I said, well, you know. Doesn't mean that they won't put them inside at the work. I, I can't see the work being, they'd be sad. What do you think? Do you, wanna, do you want to wager? I think they're keeping him. I think it's going to be a door office cat. I think they're keeping him at home. No, you're probably right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> The breakfast stream. <laughs> it's kind of like the breakfast club, but stream-wise. And it is supposed uh, to keep snowing for the next three hours. So, is it really? Yep. This Somebody said, I couldn't read who it was, but it said, But Jessica, you don't have nine dogs. You're right. But if you added up the weight of all of Dan and Crystal's cats. By the way, if you guys don't know who I'm talking about, Dan and Crystal, uh, the moderator of the stream, RFS Dan, is who actually edits our videos. He's a very good friend of mine. Um, him and Crystal both. And they do live streams as well. So, technically, if you added up the weight of all of Dan's cats and then added up the weight of all of our dogs, we have about the same amount of animals. You know, I, I think we have pretty much the exact same amount of animals. There you go. Dan dropped his uh, link down in, the, down in the chat. If you guys want to check out his channel, he does live streams as well, only with cats. It's gone to the, what would you call that? The sand cats? How would you? Because they live in the desert. Would it be gone to the sand cats? <laughs> It's just RFS cats and RFS Dan and RFS all the things. Uh, how are Danielle and the kids doing? Somebody asked me a second ago how Danielle, <laughs> how Danielle was doing. Um, uh, how is Danielle doing? I'm like, I already forgot what I was talking about. She's, she's doing okay. She's downstate right now getting another round of chemo, and then she's got two more rounds after that, and then we'll see where we go from there. We'll probably be doing some updates on the GoFundMe for her soon-ish. Hopefully. We'll see. But she's in good spirits, which is good. She is in good spirits. Hi, Memphis. I saw them tipper tappers. Oh, there to go. Dare to tipper tappers. When do you plan on getting another dog? I have three dogs. I don't need another one. Thank you. Gone to the desert cats. Yeah, there you go. Uh, uh. The rescue, the dogs that we help transport to the rescue, they're all doing really, really good. Uh, when do you plan on getting another dog? No. What would, oh, I can't, I can't, I couldn't read it. Tipper Tappers, back over 500 again. I don't know how to do, I'm afraid to push these buttons on the side because I don't know what they do. Is Dan coming to the Chantilly Pet Expo? Yes. 
uh, I think the only one he may or we we don't know if he's coming to is the one that's in uh, Victoria. The one in Victoria, British Columbia. Hi, you got an itchy ear again? Um, that's the only one I'm not sure. Are female huskies better than male huskies? No, not really. Really, it's it has nothing to do with that. It's more about their temperament and their you know how they were bred and what type of temperament they had. That to me seems to make a bigger difference in whether or not they're male or female. I have met male huskies that are identical to Memphis. I've met male huskies that are identical to Kira. Um, so I think it has more to do with their temperament than anything else. Are we allowed to bring cat treats for Dan and Greg? Yes, you are. Um, you guys can bring anything. Hey, give me that. Drop it. Drop it. I see what you're doing. Give me it. Thank you. Um, yes, you are allowed to bring cat treats for Dan and Greg to any of the expos. Anything you want to bring to Dan or Greg, which if you guys don't know Greg, he helps us out a lot with the dogs as well. Um, if Greg's not there, we can take his stuff home to him, and then Dan should be at most of the expos, like I was just saying. Uh, I forgot what I was going with that. Dan will be at most of the expos. And Greg, I believe, is coming to Canada. He'll be, or er, to Toronto, at least. I'm going to come sit over here, because I think the lighting is a little better. Oh, yeah, that's much better. You're not so dark now. So, hi. Um, oh, it's super windy. Greg is coming to Toronto, and... He might be coming to Virginia. He hasn't decided yet. So it just depends. Hi. You cannot have this because I know what you're going to try to do with it, and I don't want you to swallow any of it. So thank you. Thank you for giving that back to me. Here, how about you take this and go that way? Good job. <laughs> Good job. Good job. But, yeah, you guys can bring whatever you want. Well, uh, hi, Eleanor's belly. Is this what you want? Squishy belly? Squishy belly? You're just going to stand right in front of me? Oh my god, I, ac I scrolled and I accidentally went on a live. Oh, I don't. Uh, I'll read that later. If you're new here, we have meet and greets for the dogs. Oh, yeah. If you're new here, that's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the meet and greets that we're doing for the dogs, for the different places that we're going where you guys can meet the dogs in person. Why is there a GoFundMe? The GoFundMe is for my brother and his wife. My sister in law has cancer, so it's to help them out. I hope Greg comes to Virginia. I would love to meet him too. The, t the tentative plan is for Greg to come to Virginia. Uh, it wasn't in the plans in the beginning, so we're going to be crammed into an Airbnb with not necessarily enough beds, but we will figure that out like we always do. But I do believe Greg is coming to Virginia as long as we have somebody to watch his cats for those few days. Cyber Husky! Oops, wrong button. Gillies, 93 days seizure free! That is so awesome. So awesome. Hi, Eleanor. I came to sit over here because I thought it would be better lighting and Eleanor just wants in my face. <laughs> Have you ever had a cat? Yes, a long time ago we had a cat named Bonnie and we moved out to Arizona because my aunt's husband had passed away. So Jamie and I moved out to Arizona to help her out and we took the cat with us to Arizona and we lived out there for two and a half years. So Bonnie was like three or four at the time. But Bonnie, you know, cats and dogs really will bond with certain people. Bonnie absolutely loved my aunt and when I guess I gotta sit up here if you're just gonna keep walking in front of me when we ended up moving from Arizona my aunt was gonna be living at the house all by herself again because we were moving back to Michigan and the cat was so in love with her and we had gotten Shiloh and Shiloh was you know she was okay with the cat but she also harassed the cat so we ended up talking to my aunt and we decided to go ahead and let my aunt keep her so she would not be alone and it worked out great my aunt has a cottage up here in michigan so every summer my aunt would come back to michigan and she would bring bonnie so we would get to see her and hang out with her in the summer and she lived to be about i think she was 14 when she passed away but i don't remember so yes we did have a cat and she was a typical cat she didn't like anybody but my aunt which is why we decided to let my aunt have her and it worked out great it worked out great. You look like a car salesman's daughter. Um, I could sell you a car. <laughs> Funny as it is, I actually used to want to be a car salesman. I used to be in sales. I love to sell things. I was a real estate agent. I always thought being a car salesman would be fun. Or an RV salesman would be fun. I guess saleswoman. I don't know how you properly say the things anymore. I like to sell stuff to people. It's fun. It is actually fun. It's a challenge, and I, I like that. I've worked in commission-based sales a few times, and I had a lot of fun with it. 
video idea. Go hiking on a cold mountain with your huskies. Uh, we don't live by mountains, so it's not as easy as you think. How are the rescued husky pups? They're doing really good. Whoa! Don't drop the camera. You are in sales. You're right, Jim. I am in sales. I am in sales. Oh, please don't do that. What are you doing? Weirdo. You weirdo. Dun, 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 dun. What would you have named the dogs if they were boys? I have no idea. Oh. <laughs> what you got, Kira? Is that your toy? It's like, oh my god, this is my toy. I want a husky, but... Wait, stop. I gotta read this. I really want a husky, but I'm gonna have to put up with all the shedding, especially living in... You have a pit bull. Yeah, huskies do shed a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. What you got there? Yeah? Are you tearing that toy up now as well? She's like, I'm tearing the toy up. Eleanor still thinks I'm going to give her back the squeaker, and I'm not, ma'am. How are Greg's cats doing since the fire? Uh, they're actually doing really good. I was out there not too long ago, and they're, they are. They actually are doing really good. How's Eric? Eric's okay. He's uh, sad like all of us, and every game night is a little different because Kira still stares out the window and looks for Lana, but she's getting a little better. Kira has definitely decided that... Um, she knows that Eric is kind of sad. Well, we all kind of are. So when Eric comes over, Kira's like, I'm going to snuggle you because I can. But he's coming over for game night tomorrow. We've been doing weekly game nights, and it's been amazing. And I really hope we get to play the Catan Dragon scenario tomorrow. Jamie, if you're still watching this, you should print out some cool dragons. Because we need some cool dragons. <laughs> Please make the girls sing. Jamie took the harmonica. I think he put it back. What other games do you play besides Catan? Uh, Rainbow Pirates, Unstable Unicorns, Doomlings, Everdell, uh, Catan, Catan Seafarers, Catan Barbarians and Knights, Catan Dragon Scenario, <laughs> Mario Kart, Mario Party. What other games do we play? You have some more. I can't think, my brain just stopped. I'm like, what What other games do we play? Oh, you got the harmonica. Yes, Thanks. I was still oh. It's crazy snowing again. It's crazy snowing again. Check this out, you guys. Look at this. Well, let's, we do, should we do a winter weather forecast? Okay. Winter weather advisory happening right now. Oh my gosh, it's crazy, crazy snowing again. Huh. I should go do my little uh, sideways blowing thing on the street pole. Yes, you should. You should. <laughs> I dare you. No I dare you do it. Go out there, do it on the tree. You get splinters. <laughs> winter weather advisory. I thought the winter weather advisory ended at four. Did they up it? So it's no. oh nice. Next three hours we're getting. Next three hours? Oh, we'll take it. Yeah, I look at the radar. Nah. We'll take it. This again. Oh yeah, exploding kittens. We have exploding kittens. Uh, uh, what's the other one? Not Mario Kart. What's the other one? Mario Party. Jackbox. Jackbox. We do a lot of Jackbox. What's the game? <sighs> Casting Shadows. We have not played yeah. Casting Shadows yeah. in a while, but I have the entire Kickstarter version Everdell. for that. I said Everdell. I did. They did say that one. We have Clue. We have Monopoly. We have Mario Monopoly. We have Simpsons Clue. Cigarata. Flux. Flux. Yep. Oh yeah, Sagrada. Is that how you say that? Yeah. Say yeah. We have a lot of games. Like a lot of games. Like a lot, a lot, a lot of games. Uh, we've done Jenga. We have done Jenga. We haven't done that in a while. Did you hear me say print some cool dragons before tomorrow? Please. <laughs> Maybe. We need some cool dragons. We should print the, we should fix the uh, knights before tomorrow. Mm. I love you. <laughs> Do all the things, Jamie. Mm -hmm. Uh... Is Dan coming to carve pumpkins? I don't. He said he wanted to, so I don't know. We have Uno, but we don't really play Uno. Yeah, the Rainbow Pirates is kind of like that. Yeah, kind of. What was that? I don't do kind of like a. What are you doing, Kira? It's like I'm getting into this. Huh. Pandemic. We've played Pandemic. Yeah. Now I'm trying to think of like all the games we've played. We have a lot. Settlers Across America. 
I don't have that train game. The that's one that I that I wanted, but I but I don't have. I've been watching you guys since I was five. That's awesome. Is there gonna be more treat videos soon? You're on the wrong channel. That's on the dog's channel. What? Are you sound? It sounds so weird. Did you hear they're making a prequel to Nightmare Before Christmas? It was a book. It already came out. I thought. Did you show the you? You showed this channel the things I printed up there on the... I showed them on the vlog, but not on the live stream. Well, no, no. Crystal the Animal Lover! Thank you for your member super chat! Member for 17 months. I, we don't have Oregon Trail, the um, the board game. Uh, I play Catan. I love Catan. We have a whole 3D printout of Catan. That's, like, my favoritest one. All right, let's see if I can get him to go. Ready? Uh, she might not, because she's chewing on the thing. Eleanor. 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 You want to sing? They're like, nope, we're chewing on this thing. Leave us alone. Hey, how about, let's not fight up over it. it one of you at a time can chew on it. <laughs> I just joined and saw these two pups. What are they? They're Siberian Huskies, and there's three of them. This one's over here snuggling. Snuggling. You gonna do some tipper tappers for us? She's like, I am the sweetest pupper on the planet. Sweetest pupper on the planet. Can you take your toy? Are you gonna come to Indiana sometime soon? Uh, Nova is probably the closest we will be to there, which isn't that far away. The Ticket to Ride, that's the game I was thinking of. I don't have that one. That's one that I've been thinking about getting, but I don't have it. And then there's Isle of Cats. Oh, Dan, you should get that game. Isle of Cats is another game that I've really been considering getting. I have a board game problem, if you cannot tell. Take the pups out in the snow. No way, it's cold and windy out there. You guys wouldn't be able to hear us because of the wind. Yeah, because of the wind. Uh, gone to the Snow Dogs Monopoly. <laughs> Ticket to Ride looks like a really fun game. I, we haven't played Wingspan. That's another game that I've looked at. Everdell is my current, the current newest game that we just got. Even though it's been out for a while, we just got it. Splendor. Have we played Splendor? Why does that sound familiar? Probably on my list of games that I have wanted to get. <laughs> Any more camping in the future? Oh, yeah, we'll totally get right on that. Don't you want to go camping in that? We can't camp in the wintertime. It's wintertime. The RV is covered in snow. Cards, yes, we do have Cards Against Humanity. I have tons of cards for Cards Against Humanity, actually. We don't play that one very often, but we do have it. One Night Werewolf or whatever it is, we play that every once in a while. Hey. Thank you. Another game like One Night Appreciate you. Another game like One Night Werewolf. Yeah. Secret Hitler! Another game, like that's werewolf. that's the like where what's the other game like werewolf? That was it. Oh yeah. It sounds like it sounds like a horrible game. People are always like, wait, what's the name of this game? It's Secret Hitler. If you've never played it, it's actually kind of a fun game for a big group of people. All right, Ellen, over here. Ready? Here, I'm throwing you this. Maybe oh, good catch. Maybe you can get her to do it. Now that I took her toy away. She's like, ah, thinking about it. If you get a Snow Dogs Monopoly made, I'm totally, I'd totally buy it. You can make custom versions of Monopoly. There's a website where you can go to do, like, fundraisers and stuff and make custom versions of Monopoly. I don't know that enough people would buy a Gone to the Snow Dogs Monopoly version for me to be able to do it, but... Wait, I saw something. Sadie's doing good. Which reminds me, don't let... There she goes. Sing! 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 Memphis was seriously thinking about it. Can we can we sing again? Hmm? Eleanor. 
Look, Memphis is thinking about it. She's stretching her jaw. Go, Memphis, go! Sing, Memphis, sing! Memphis. Sing! Sing, <laughs> sing Eleanor, sing! <laughs> yeah? Sing! She's got Almost. the look. She's ready to do it. She's like, hi, Dad. No, maybe not. <laughs> no, maybe not. No, maybe not. What's for dinner tonight? I don't remember. What did, uh, what did we say we were making for dinner? Quesadillas. 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 Uh, Quesadillas. It's a croissant. <laughs> I can't say it without picturing that dog. <laughs> oh. Alexia is outside answering the house. I love it. Did I say the name right? Is the dog chewing on us? Yes. Okay. Um, Shelby chewed on it. A it's long, definitely meant. A long time ago, Shelby chewed on it. Okay. Yeah. I have a new one, but. Yeah, I think I know. That one has meaning. One. Yeah, you, the blue one? Maybe. Yeah. But this one's a little harder to play. Yeah, because Shelby chewed at it. <laughs> Close enough? Oh, I tried. Uh, I tried. I really did. Oh my gosh, we've been live for an hour and ten minutes. Woo! Is there a hockey game tonight? Uh, maybe. I had no clue you went live. Hi, friend! Hey, we're live. Surprise, we're live. Hey! I should message you. Do you want your dog sled? <laughs> I thought about you this morning when it started snowing. I'm like, I have to get Marie her dog sled. I knew somebody was going to say it. What? They just, well, they politely said, I love Jamie Howling. I love Jamie Howling. <laughs> and I'm like, I knew somebody was going to pick on me for Howling. And I, I try to be quiet, but they need a little bit of encouragement. They do. They do. So, but yeah, I want to be quiet so that you guys can actually hear the dogs. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure you can hear them. Yeah, they're pretty loud. Oh, and we're squishing the puppy. Stop squishing the puppy. Memphis is like, I'm roughing this. I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna throw the flag on the play. <laughs> oh, look out, Memphis! She got you. Oh man, you better watch hitting your sister. While Kira will just reach her paw up and bop Memphis. Yeah. Yes, you want the sled. We should figure that out. I don't have a rat. Can we get the sled over to Marie's house? The purple one. Uh, the purple one? Yeah. Will it fit in your truck? In your Jeep? It won't fit. It, I, I don't think it'll fit in mine. But I'll message you after the live stream. But we, I should figure that out. Because you should get it so we can use it. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Detroit plays tonight on the West Coast. They're playing in Canada. Oh, they're playing the Canucks? Oh, my goodness. Maybe it'll be a... 8-5 game, and we'll win this time. <laughs> An 8-5 game? Yeah, maybe. Let's see. Oh, Memphis, you gonna get her? Are you gonna get her? Bye, Crystal. I hope you're feeling better. Ooh, if we get a new puppy, what would you name it? I'm a... No. Veruca. <laughs> I don't have a name. I if don't... we get a new puppy, what would you name it? I wouldn't name it until I saw it. I don't... Jamie's not really good at naming dogs until he sees them. I have a problem with getting stuck on names. I knew that Kira was going to be named Kira before we got her because I got stuck on the name. And then we knew Eleanor was going to be named Eleanor because we wanted to honor Shelby. So we named her Eleanor. But, like, but we knew we were going to name her Eleanor before we got her. The Memphis other name, kind of the same Memphis, thing. kind of the same way. I do like the Shelby name Sway. If we're going with more more names from the movie Gone in 60 Seconds, I do like the name Sway. I think it's cute. It's short. But it starts with an S. Right. I like... I, I, no, I know we're never going to have a dog named Veruca. I mean, maybe. It's so cute. Yeah, I'd have, to, I'd have to see it. You know that if we had a dog and we named it Veruca, it would have so much attitude. <laughs> <laughs> uh. 
I mean, a lot of our dogs could have been named that, but, you know. A lot of our dogs could have been named that. <laughs> no, they're not fighting. They're just playing. I need to do another one of those videos. Oh my goodness. I need to do another one of those video of the things husky owners say. Do you remember all those years ago when we did the things husky owners say? Yeah. And we were like, no, they're not wolves. <laughs> no, they're just playing. She's playing. She's playing. Kira. She's trying to play with Memphis. I see her. I, the other day, they actually played together for a couple minutes. Yeah. But I had to get Kira away from him. Eleanor does has her moments where she's very gentle and wants to play with Memphis. Yeah, and it's and really I, I cute. Think they know. Kira. Yeah. Look right there. Right. Kira, yeah. come here. Come here. Leave Eleanor alone for a second. But I don't know. And then she gets distracted go, because go she's play. like, wait, what do you want the yeah. dog for? She's like, woo, woo, what are you doing? Oh, by the way, it quit snowing. Oh, uh, yeah. Still windy. Oh my gosh, my little spinning hummingbird out there is gonna fly away. Right. Fly away. Oh, somebody else is doing snow out there. Get him out. Here to snowblower. Get a Memphis. I hear the Get snow Memphis. blower. No. Memphis is thinking about it. Yeah. They're, like, They're oh, so cute. They're so cute. They are pretty cute. Most days. Have a great evening. You too. Oh my goodness. Do you? Who's out there with the snowblower? Is that the neighbor across the street? Is she snowblower in? He's like, you did Remy's DNA. Did you do Remy's DNA? I don't know if I, did you do a video on that? You should send it to me. What does it say? Well, that's because Veruca Salt from Willy Wonka is loaded with attitude. I know. Tell me that's not a cute name, though, for like a red husky. Although I always said if I had a red husky, I'd name her Ruby Sue, which would kind of be in honor of Memphis Belle. I would want a Ruby Sue. Name a dog Ruby. I could picture a but then it'd, it'd most likely be a red or red. Yeah, a red, yeah, like a copper red, like a deep red, and we'd name her Ruby, and then we'd have to sing the the Kenny Rogers song. Ruby, don't take your love down. That's all I can think of when I hear the name. Bitch, that, then my Aunt Ruby. <laughs> have you seen the new Wonka yet? No, I have not. I want to see it, but I have not. Go fluff your bed? She doesn't know how to do it. Oh, you almost did it. Emma. Every time she almost does it, and then she forgets. She did, like, one or two kicks, and then it. Would you name one Jack after the night before Christmas? Nightmare before Christmas? No. And I'm not a huge fan of the name Sally for a dog. Zero is cute, but the only way I would name a dog Zero if it was a pure white husky. I mean, we had a close one there, but she's our Memphis. Yeah, I don't know that I would want to name a dog Zero. Like, I love that movie, but, you know. But, like, if I had cats, I might most definitely have, like, a lock, shock, and barrel. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If we had cats, I would I would be more more into the Nightmare Before Christmas names. I mean, if we had three Huskies named Lock, Shock, and Barrel, that'd be kind of cute, too. But we'd have to get them all at the same time, and I don't want to do that. <laughs> right. that. Yeah, I guess that's kind of... Uh. That would be cute, though. <laughs> we name you Oogie Boogie. <laughs> Oogie? We call you Oogie? That would have been a really cute name for Oakley. Because I mean, she was so big and floofy. Yeah. But we didn't name her. She came with that name. Yeah, she a fluffy butt. Work. I mean, yeah. they're all kind of fluffy butts. They are kind of all fluffy butts. They definitely are little fluffer butts, huh? Little fluffy butts. Oh, okay. It's 20 after something. It's about that time. In a minute, I'm gonna need a cinnamon roll to pump me up. Mm, <laughs> uh, oh my goodness. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Nick. Um, Which means... I missed it. I missed it. We missed it. Where did you get Memphis Bell from? Michigan. I also think that if I would have known that Kira was going to be such an ice princess, we could have named her Elsa instead of Kira. But at the same time, I also feel like a lot of people named their dogs Elsa. So I think Kira is good enough, and we just call her the ice princess. Whoa! Look it! Look it! 
Look at it. Did you see it? It happened. It happened. Kira. You, Kira, go in with your dad for two seconds. Let those two play. Just let oh, him. No. Hopefully it didn't freeze for you guys, too. Uh-oh, did it freeze for you? It might have just been my phone. They're playing. They're doing it. They're they're doing it. I said, just grab Kira. <laughs> Here she's coming back. They're gonna do it again. Oh, she saw you. <laughs> oh, I play. Go play with Memphis. Yeah, go play with Memphis. It's the cutest thing ever. Here it happens. It's gonna happen. Get her. Memphis is like, Get her, mm, I changed my mind. So like, I changed my mind. Good job, Memphis. I love you. I saw it. I saw it. You can buy it. She's like, mm, yeah, no. Sure. And Eleanor's never sure. Like, Eleanor doesn't want to start it with Memphis. Right. Because she's like, I don't want to start it. Memphis has to start it. But as soon as Memphis starts it, she's like, ooh. <gasps> Memphis is like, oh, you got my toy. That's my toy. I love this toy. That's my toy. It's like, I got this toy. Did you see? Dad's got my toy. It's so fun. That's my little yammy chops. Get it, Memphis. Get that little yammy chops. Get it, Memphis. Whoop, there's Eleanor, but she's like, oh, boop, hi. Almost got you. Hi. I was going to say, sneak the other two dogs into that room and bring her green toy back in here. If well, it's got... Sneak them to in, that'd be... Yeah. Mm -hmm. no, no. Hurry up. I was going to say, Memphis is coming. <laughs> you can give the other two a cookie. If it's got, hopefully it's got batteries in it. If not, do we have a back on? I don't know. Oh, is it dead? Yeah. Okay. One? I do. I'll go get it. I'll set the camera right here. I'll be right back, guys. Hopefully the other one's charged. I'll, we, I'll see if we can replace it. It looks like these are like giant batteries. Those are D batteries. Yeah, like we live in the past. How many things use D batteries? Oh, look. I got oh, one. Yeah. There you go. That one's just slow. <laughs> Get in it. Get it. She's like, but it's slow and it doesn't make the noise. Memphis and her cat. All right, I'll look for it, even though she's going to be distracted. I think they're D batteries. There might be some in the bottom drawer. I, somehow, I think I can make this one faster, but I don't remember how. Let's see if I hold it. Does it change color? Oh, there's the blue. Memphis, look! Memphis! I made it go faster, Memphis! Memphis, look! Which one? <laughs> <laughs> crazy guys a crazy this is a cat toy Memphis loves cat toys if you don't know there, there we go the feather on this one likes to get oh there it goes there it is yes get it get it Memphis <laughs> get it Memphis beautiful dog thank you here you go there's your cat toy like, I don't know, Dad's got something. Maybe he's got something for me. You getting it? <laughs> oh, it's moving, Memphis. So the other one makes like a chirpy noise, and she really, really, really likes the chirpy noise. Was Memphis a cat in a previous life? Possibly. Oh, here she goes. Oh, yeah, get it. Did you fix it? There it is. See, that one makes the chirpy noises. Yeah, so leave that one there and see. <laughs> She's like, oh, I'm going to push this one around the floor. I think she likes that one because she can push it. Right. But it's, see how slow it is? See how it's not doing anything? What about this one, Memphis? Look. 
Look at this one. Look, this one. She's like, no, Dad, I want the one you have. Mom, give that one to me. I like that one, please. <laughs> oh, look at her. She goes straight to the green one. She's like, oh, wait a minute. Get it. Get it. I think she likes this one because she can throw it. She can flip it over and throw it. You gotta get it? You get it? Hey, Eleanor is really good though. She gets it. Oh, she's been missing though. You hit the button. Oh, you cheater. You made it go slower. You yeah. did. You cheater. You made it go slower. Oh, I think she uh, she got it stuck, so it won't. We have to calibrate it. I hear it, Memphis. It's stuck over here in the corner. Hold on, I get it. Here, look out. Let me get it. I think this has one other setting. Let's see if I can do it. Is it this one? This one needs to be charged. There you go. There you go. Let's throw it across the room. Yeah! <laughs> Too much fun. All right, I'll charge that one before Saturday. <laughs> All right, we're going to go make dinner. We've been live for like an hour and a half. There you go. I picked, I picked that one up before she saw it. We've been live for like an hour and a half, so we're going to go make some dinner, do some things. If you're new here, and you like the dogs, and you like what you saw, you should totally click that subscribe button, click that bell, turn on all notifications so you can be notified whenever we put up a new video or whenever we go live. Be careful, because they will collide. You should make it do make them do it one at a time. We're not ending the live stream yet, because now it's not, I was gonna say, I'm helping, I'm helping, I'm helping. Keep, Eleanor, go, go, go. Dad will play with you next, I promise. It's gotta be one at a time. Oh my goodness. Wait, let me get to the other side of the room. Okay. She won't keep it for too long. No. No. She's like, I want to play with it, so you have to make it run. <laughs> you can't trip on it. She's like, I tripped on it. <laughs> What's that? Oh my gosh, you guys, you're going to make me crazy. That's Kira's favorite toy on the planet. It's her tail teaser. And she's super fast. So sorry if I'm making you dizzy. How do you make quesadillas? Cheese and sauce and black olives? Yeah, cheese, chicken, jalapenos, some sauce, and some tortillas. What kind of sauce? Uh, the, what's it called? The Baja sauce from Taco Bell. And cream cheese or something you said? Or... And cheese. Cheese. Yeah. Memphis! Wow! Whoa, my gosh. In the camera that looked like it was going to hit me in the head. <laughs> Look out. Okay, Memphis is in the middle. Good job. Get it. Get it. Get it. Sorry, but... <laughs> okay, you better play with Eleanor. Did you get under that couch? Yeah. Kira loves that toy, like, more than anything. Good girl. It's like, this is the greatest Kira. moment in my life. Go, Kira. It's Eleanor's turn. And as funny as it is, watch. So if you guys didn't realize, there's two of those. The one that Jamie had is specifically Kira's. And then the did one... I do it right? You I did. did yes. It it's com No, you didn't. That's right. That's why it's confusing. Kira's is not black and white. Kira's is brown. Mm -hmm. And Eleanor's is black and white. She got it. She don't let go. She just does not let go. She's like, I got it, Dad. Did you see me? 
But if you can get it away from her for long enough, she'll do the cat thing. Whoa, be careful, Elle. Maybe she won't do Maybe today she's just all kinds of crazy. Watch, jumping in the beanbag chair, uh, you weirdo. Let her get it. Wow. You are all <laughs> kinds of crazy today. She's like, did you see me, guys? I'm crazy. Oh, Memphis, here. Good girl. You want to, um, there you go. <laughs> She's like, whoa, wait, that toy's amazing. Memphis pushed it while it was sitting on the couch, so I turned it back on for her. Can I leave him somewhere? Can we get it? She is not about to let you do the cat game with her. Whoa, Memphis! <laughs> People are always like, Memphis doesn't play anymore. Yes, she does. We just don't film it enough. <laughs> Oh, you're going to throw it off the couch? You threw it off the couch. Look at her. She's like, it's in the pile of toys. What am I going to do now? It's stuck in the pile of toys. Her head. She's like, Dad, did you see my toy? It's in the pile of toys. Yeah, get it. Yeah, get it. Yeah, get it. Get it, Memphis. Can you make it quiet somehow? That one doesn't chirp. The other one chirps. This one just has the electronic motion noise. And the batteries are dying on it, so. Get him, Memphis. Yeah, good girl. Whoa, look out, crazy puppy alert. All right, Kira, Kira looks sad. She can do it. <laughs> oh, here it is, there it is, there it is. Now move it very, very slowly. The cat move, boom! <laughs> We hear you, Kira. We're letting you back in here. So the reason we have to let one dog out of the room and then one they, dog in the they room... They get it at the same exact time. And they will collide their jaws, and we do not want broken teeth. Like, they play with it together fine. And when they play together, they're pretty good at not clicking teeth. Mm, sometimes. But, but when they go after this, they yes. get it at the same exact time. Yeah. They always end up clicking teeth because we they don't, don't. We don't need no skulls yeah, bouncing yeah, off each other. Yeah. So, yeah. so we we take turns with them and each of them have their own one of those toys. Memphis has a tail teaser toy as well. Hers is a dragonfly, but she is happy as could be to be playing with this toy right now. Oh, she hears that, but she's still into this. Whoa! Oh my goodness. It's it. <laughs> Honey, it's bad. Do I Oh, I knew you were going to do it. Oh, I tried to save it. Previously, it landed on soccer things. Yeah. There you go. You going for it again? Or are you good? So I'm thinking about it. I say, she don't want that. She wants this toy. This is her favorite toy. <laughs> I got to charge this. Don't let me forget to charge this. There, are you done with that one? You look so happy. I am so happy. Memphis has dragonfly toys in the office. But I don't think she's going to play with it because the other toy's out here. I'm so it's like, nope, right, I'm playing right. with this. Okay, we're really going to go this time, and we're really going to go make dinner for reals this time. So thank you guys for coming to hang out with us for this live stream. I did not plan on going live for an hour and a half, but uh, it looks like we did. So we're going to go ahead and end today's live stream again. Down in the video description below, there is a bunch of links. If you guys want to follow us on all of our other social sites like Instagram, the Tiki Takis, Facebook, which nobody's on anymore, but, you know, we're still on there as well. And then the lists of our events. If you go to gondothesnowdogs.com in the right-hand corner, there's a thing that says meet and greets. That's actually got a link to all of the events that we're going to be at so far this year where you can get a chance to come and meet the dogs in person. Pinned up at the top is the link for the Kira plushie. There's only seven days left to get your Ice Princess Kira plushie if you would like to get an Ice Princess Kira plushie with her little frozen apple. Yay! She's so cute. <laughs> so cute. So, all right, you guys. Thanks for joining the live stream. No, don't you dare crawl up in there. No, we're not doing that. We don't need no broken legs. <laughs> Thank you guys for joining the live stream. Thank you to everybody new that stopped by and hung out with us and said hello. That was really fun. It was nice to see some new people. And hopefully some of you guys have now become audience members and you're going to hang out with us for a while. All right, you guys. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. 
and we will see you again soon. Thank you for the reminder to turn that water bowl back on and fill it because I'm pretty sure you have emptied it. Goodbye, potty.